video loading video unavailable click to play tap to play the video will start in 8 cancel play now Liverpool and Manchester City are fighting it out at the top of the Premier League table but have yet to make their move in the January transfer window. Chelsea have been the most active out of the top six, bringing in Borussia Dortmund's Christian Pulisic, while they are closing in on the loan signing of Gonzalo Higuain from Juventus. Unai Emery has revealed he is hopeful of adding one player to his Arsenal squad this month, with Barcelona's Denis Suarez top of his list. Manchester United have been quiet, but they continue to be linked with Philip Kittenhoe, with Chelsea reportedly also showing an interest. City have been linked with a surprise move for Shaki midfielder Sebastian Rulli. Head this way to see every done deal from the Premier League transfer so far this window. Follow the latest transfer news and rumours live below, brought to you by Bet Hard. 10.50 Klopp speaks out on Kittenhoe Jurgen Klopp does not expect Liverpool to make a bid for Philip Kittenhoe. The former Anfield star has struggled to settle in Barcelona since leaving Merseyside 12 months ago. And Liverpool along with Manchester United have been linked a huge bid for the forward, whether this month or in the summer transfer window. But Klopp said, that is something I don't want to talk about. I would not say it is a potential transfer or a likely one. Nothing to say. Whatever I say would open more stories and there is no story. Phil is at Barcelona, and as I know he fits really well, and everything is fine. Close quote 1018 Emery provides transfer update and I Emery has revealed Arsenal Chiefs are working hard behind the scenes to boost his squad for the second half of the campaign. The Gunners are hoping to wrap up the loan signing of Barcelona midfielder Denis Suarez, with a view to a permanent deal in the summer. 9.55 Mourinho reveals job offers Jose Mourinho has revealed he has already turned down three job offers since his sacking as Manchester United manager. When quizzed whether his next move would be in England or abroad, Mourinho said, I don't know. It depends. I will analyse things. I don't like to speak about it, but I refuse already three options. Because I didn't feel it was what I want. So I'm going to be calm in this aspect. The more time I have the better I can prepare. Close quote 926 Young ready to reveal Frankie De Young is quickly becoming the name on everyone's lips this month. The Ajax midfielder will leave the club in the summer, but has yet to reveal his destination. It looked as if Paris Saint-Germain had won the race to sign the Dutchman, but now Barcelona are back in with a shout. Regardless, it looks like Manchester City will lose out. And De Jong is expected to make his decision by Wednesday. 8.57 The hope for Herrera, Ole Gunnar Solskjaer heaped praise on and a Herrera after United's win over Brighton. The Spaniard is out of contract at the end of the season, but Solskjaer offered him hope of a new deal. He said, he's a midfielder, it's a bit different to Paul, to Nemanja with their physical attributes. But he runs and he runs, he wins the ball, plays it simple, he makes some good runs into the box as well. 
even though I let Paul do more that job and Ashley from the right hand side, but I'll never stop him from making those runs into the box. And hopefully he will continue like this. I've always enjoyed watching, and are from when we signed him from Athletic Bilbao. I thought he did really well against us, when he played for them as well, so he caught my eye then. Close quote 825 Emery rules out Bellerin replacement on I Emery has ruled out bringing in a replacement for crop defender Hector Bellerin. The Arsenal star was carried off owner Stretcher in the second half of Saturday's 2-0 win over Chelsea. Boss Emery said. We have Ainsley, playing with good pieces. He played well today, and can help us playing at right back or right winger. Also Lickstiner is another player who can play there. We have the players. I don't forget Jenkinson who has played some matches, and can be used, if we need him. Close quote 803 City plotting Rude Swoop Manchester City are considering a surprise loan move for Shaki midfielder Sebastian Rude. The Sun report that Pep Guardiola is considering bringing in the 28-year-old on a short-term deal as cover for Fernandinho. The City boss knows German international Rude well from his time at Bayern Munich in the Bundesliga. 741 Reds fail with Felix bid Liverpool have reportedly had an audacious £61 million bid for attacking midfielder Joe Felix turned down by Benfica. Portuguese newspaper Correio da Manhã report via TalkSport that the Reds made a move for the 19-year-old wonder kid, but have failed in their approach. The move would have made Felix Liverpool's third most expensive signing ever, after Virgil van Dijk and Alisson. However the Merseyside club was some way off of Benfica's valuation of Felix, who has a £105 million buyout clause with the club. 738 Suarez drops big hint on social media Dennis Suarez has dropped the biggest hint yet that he is on his way to the Premier League by liking Arsenal related posts on social media. The Barcelona winger has been heavily linked with a move to the Gunners in the January window. Mirror Sport revealed that Arsenal are now prepared to pay £1.7 million to take Suarez on an initial loan deal, before a permanent £17. 5 metres deal can be completed in the summer. While the transfer is yet to be finalised, Suarez has been engaging with posts celebrating Arsenal's win over Chelsea on Saturday. 737 United battling Chelsea for kit and home Manchester United must do battle with Chelsea to bring Philip Kit and Ho back to the Premier League. Barcelona paid pounds 142 million for the Brazilian last January and he won La Liga and Copa del Rey on us in his first few months. Barker are believed to be willing to sell Kittenho to fund a potential reunion for Neymar from Paris Saint-Germain, who need to meet financial fair play regulations. The Blues have asked Barcelona to keep them in touch with any plans they have to offload former Liverpool star. Read more here.